Veg Fam, it's your girl T here. I hadn't done a car vlog in a while, so I thought I'd do one. It's Monday, and I am out running errands alone. I left the baby daddy at home. Yeah, for once he's home. No, he's home because um, he had to groom the dog today. I was not grooming the dog. So we are going to chit chat. Well, I run errands and have a doctor's appointment. I am going to a dermatologist appointment today because this new medicine that I'm on for my rash, it's, I'm not gonna say it's not working because I mean, my skin is clear but it's, I'm still burning and my skin still feels inflamed, super dry and cracked. And I'm on Eucerin and two different, um, Eucerin and two different, Eucerin and two different creams. One is a thick lotion and the other one is like a Vaseline. So, I mean, and I apply them twice a day, in the morning and at night, but it's not working. My skin still felt like it's on fire and I've not been outside. Um, I normally wait until evening to go out to do anything. Like I late, late evening and now that it gets dark early, it's even better. But hold on one second. Hold on to the ATM machine. Okay. We are back. I don't know what it is about me in this van and the drive through I am like terrified. Like it's, it's like a small crunched up area. And I'm actually going the wrong way. Yay. Let's get turned around here. Let's go the right way. But um, so <laughs> yesterday I was at home alone and I was watching them. We have this auction on Facebook, it's like a live auction here where I live. And um, I, was, I was watching it and <laughs> I've always wanted to bid on stuff. Like I have a bad addiction to shopping. Like I will shop until the cows come home and then they might leave again and come back again and I'm still shopping. Like I have a really bad addiction to shopping. I'm always on the internet ordering something. So I was on the auction page last night so I was watching them bid off stuff and I like to watch like when my friends come in or when everybody else is bidding because I just think it's the coolest thing ever and I, was, I bidded on some headphones and I'll show you the headphones once I get them because I'm going to get them now before I go to the doctor and there's some wireless Bluetooth headphones in. <laughs> And I was the first bidder because well, nobody bid on them. And I was like, you know, I'm just curious. How does this really work? You know, I mean, I know how it works, but, you know, just to do it. And I was like, $10. And they was like, we got a bidder. And the guy who runs the auction was like, oh, I got to just, they said, they was like, he had to just walk away for a minute because he was like, $10. Well, then somebody came in and said, um, I think $12.50 was the next bid, because you gotta go in 250 increments until you get the 50, and then after 50, you go fives. And so somebody said 1250, somebody was like 15. So it sat there for a while, and I was like, you know what, let's try this out. So I was like, 1750, it was the next bid on there. So I was like, we're gonna try 1750 and see what happens. I'm pretty sure somebody's gonna outbid me, and so it's fine, it's not, I mean, it's not like I was in dying need of headphones. Although I did want that, that kind of head, not that, the specific one but that kind of and that for when I'm in a gym to see how good they are because they're the the wireless over the ear headphones <laughs> so I bid at 1750 that was I was waiting I was like oh somebody gonna outbid me I cannot believe this so I'm like oh adrenaline rush adrenaline rush like oh, who gonna outbid me no one outbid me I want them for seventeen fifty, like I said, I'm going to get them now, so I'm going to post a picture of them. Um, I mean, I'll show you. 
but it was nice. It was fun. But <laughs> my name on Facebook and my name in general, it's not easy to say. And when you look at it, you you won't know how to pronounce it. It's just it's not easy to pronounce. Well, I shorthanded my name on Facebook. Just so people would be able to say it and to make it unique. And <laughs> when they said it, <laughs> he skipped the whole middle part of my name. And it was just the beginning and the end put together. So the middle just got chopped. They just got dropped. And he said, Lala. And I was like, <laughs> I was laughing. I was recording it. And I was like, Lala. It was so funny. And he's like, I know I butchered it up. And I, I, um, message back on in the auction I was like it's okay I understand it's always getting butchered so but you know you make me laugh and he was like I'm so sorry I was like oh, no you know it's good you know I was like it was so funny so I sent the clip to my daughter and to my baby daddy and they were laughing and of course my daughter who will joke with her mother about just about any and everything was like yeah that's your new name and your new aka name and I'm like yeah, that's my new AKA name, and it was really funny though. But I had fun doing it, so but I think I may have started something that's not healthy for me because when I get in my when I get in my depression phase, not, I, I wouldn't say well, yeah, when I get like down and out, and I just feel like it, either it ain't going my way or just something's ain't going right somewhere, and. I will just get on the computer and I will literally just order stuff. I don't care. Like, I order stuff for the grandbaby. I'll order stuff for me. And, like, last night before I went to bed, I had showed him one of my prior videos that I had just got another coloring book in the mail. Um, I went to bed. Before I went to bed, I counted my coloring books to see how many I had. And I had six so far. And I was like, no more. I was, I mean, don't get me wrong. I'm coloring in them and I'll, I'll show you that I am. I color in them all the time. And I'll start a page. And I may not finish it. I'll skip to another page. And I'll come back to that page and do some more. But I was like, no more coloring books until after February. So, we're in the process now of saying no more coloring books for Taylor. Adult coloring books. Let me get that right. Adult coloring books until after February because I have six of them so far and so but yeah it was it was fun just the bid on the auction and the adrenaline I'm going to pick it up now and see what they, see how good they are um, I will continue this video once I um, once I get them and get them charged and we'll see how good they are we um, went on Amazon to see the actual price of them. The actual price was like $30. And I got them for, I don't have people to take their time crossing the street, but you can't get them. Granted, you're not supposed to, but it's, it's just ridiculous. Um, they were originally $30 on Amazon, $30 and up. And I got mine for $17.50 bidding on the auction last night, so. I got a pretty good deal. My baby daddy was like, hmm, you did pretty good. You got a $10 discount. <laughs> like, <laughs> I was like, yay. You know, for once me not knowing what I was doing and then think to look more into because normally when people are bidding on stuff, I go look it up. And last night, I didn't even do those headphones like that. I was just, oh, let's bid and see what happens. You know. But anyway, so I am here to pick them up and I will be back to let you know how they are. Okay, we're back. Oh yeah, by the way, I did my hair different today. If my West Virginia butt went, kinda wish I wouldn't have put it on there. But here's the headphones. When I went in there, they were laughing. He's like, I know I pronounced it wrong. I was like, oh, it's fine. But.
but yeah, here they are. So we are about to see. They look like they've been returned. About to see Hey Vedora. I'll be back. Hey, Veg fam. So I am back. And I am back to say that I'm leaving the dermatologist and it's another flare up. My, you can tell it's swollen on the side. Then my forehead swollen. <laughs> my forehead being swollen reminds me of another YouTuber or not. But anyway, I'm not one to crack jokes to nobody. But my forehead is, is inflamed and so ain't this side, but this side is the side that is um, itching and burning and feels swollen real bad. So we're going through another breakout. Um, she recalled my medicine in. But anyway, I wanted to call and update you on the headphones. I currently have them on charge. So they're charging and there's a little... I don't know if y'all be able to see it, but there's a little red light down there that lets you know it's charging. Oh, there it is. It's right there. Oh, you can't see it because the light just really. Oh, well, there it is. See it right there. But anyway, but I like how the inside of them says right and left, and they actually this when you slide them up. As far as they go but um let's see let's disconnect them then when you put them on I can't talk with them on because I feel like I'm being smothered, muzzled. But um, maybe once I get in the gym and get music playing, which is my motivation to keep me working out, then it'll be nice. But yeah, this is what the side of them. I'm trying to see where they. No, but I'll go home and read the manual and see. Yeah, there they go out of the box. I think it was well worth my seventeen dollars. It was well worth it. But anyway, so I am going to. Oh, and by the way, this is compatible with iPhone, iPods, all your handheld systems, and your TV. It says it's compatible with iPhone, iPod, smartphones, and other devices. It's Bluetooth. It's Bluetooth connected. And there it is. So, I will do like another, like I said, update on them. Um, once I try them out for sure. Like in the gym for sure, because I'm always like on the treadmill, on the elliptical, or jumping rope, stuff like that. So, yeah. We'll do an update when I do go to the gym, which is probably going to be, if it's not tonight, it will be in the morning. Um, in the morning before I, I mean, in the morning when maybe daddy get off work. But anyway, alrighty, we are going to go get something to eat. I would chit chat on the way, but I don't know what to talk about. Kind of up in limbo about what to talk about so I'm not going to talk about anything because I'm not going to hold you up anymore I'm going to go get him five guys because I don't and I'm headed to get him five guys oh gosh <laughs> when I can see my double chin I know I'm fat and need to lose weight like I don't like the double chin but you know I, I think back when my grandmother was alive and she was in the stages of you know starting to pass away and I went to go see her and this is when my little girl was <laughs> my little girl had to be about mm, four maybe and my grandmother seen me and she was like oh baby you're getting fat you need to lose some weight I'm just like 
granny. I was like, you bigger than me. And at the time, I was smaller than what I am now. I was like 200 pounds, maybe. <laughs> and on my dad's side of the family, like all the women are big. All of them. From my great-grandmother, my grandmother's twin sister, their sister, my aunts, all of them are, like, we're some thick, healthy women. Like, that's just, my mom always say that I'm the one who got dad's genes more than anybody else. Because my brother, he's real muscular and built and tall and I'm short and just stumpy and fat. <laughs> but anyway, so, but when I could see a double chin, I just think, oh, it's time to definitely get, like, serious and, like, do two rounds in the gym. But I could see my face is swelling it's bad but anyway um i am going to like i said get him five guys and figure out what i want i think i want to don't need it but i'm gonna get a thin crust cheese pizza from little seizures that sounds good with some ranch dressing at home but anyway i have a lemon dum dum look it's a pretty green this is what I'm going to eat going down the right. So, I'll be back. Alright. Hey. Okay, I'm back. If you hear anything, my dog is in there scratching her bed. But, um, I said I was going to come back and show y'all the burger. So, this is how it's wrapped up. Alright. My camera is on um, manual focus and it may not zoom in on it, but this is nasty. <laughs> yeah. You see it? Like, it just, the bread is soggy. Like, it's gross. But it's. Hope can't see it, but there's no meat on it. But it's just gross. I don't like messy food, but let's taste it and see. I have a big pet peeve when it comes to my hands touching anything wet I immediately think when they get wet that it's I mean I know this is food but like if I go to the sink or if my hands get wet and I don't know what the liquid is I think it's bodily fluids I, <laughs> I think it's from working in the um, home in home health care and I've dealt with a lot of stuff a lot of bodily fluids because I was like certified in a lot of stuff and then I have my uh, medical degrees. So it just terrifies me of like germs and fluids and all the stuff you can get. Ugh. It, yeah. But anyway, let's try this. There's a green pepper. Lettuce. That's lettuce. And then those are the mushrooms. Me personally, maybe it's because I grew up eating seasoned food. This needs some kind of salt, some kind of seasoning, a meat tenderizer, maybe. Like I said, the bun is soggy. I had cheese put on it, but you can't even taste cheese at all. And I love cheese. It wouldn't be bad at all if it had a little bit of salt, something to, to give you a taste because you can't taste the cheese. Let me wait eating my dog sitting at the gate. I thought she was sitting there, I was gonna give her a french fry. I forgot to run that errand. I'm gonna do it tomorrow, sorry, bring for it. But uh, I never thought about doing it for the meat part of the burger. So this is what I have left. 
gross. There it is then. Ah! Now I have to say, the mushroom with the cheese and just the onion, maybe the bread is what's drying out to taste. Mm. I like that. That bite I just took was pretty damn good. Oof. I am over full, but yet and still trying to finish off this last. <sighs> like maybe if I move around, <sighs> I got this air bubble up out of me. Everyone's moving, I can feel it. <sighs> Yay, I did it. <laughs> and it gave me the hiccups. Bread always gives me the hiccups. French fries, crackers, all that stuff gives me the hiccups. Okay, well, I'm going to if you hear the train, it's a train on the tracks. We live like a couple houses down from the train tracks. I'm gonna go ahead and end this video and pick up this food off the floor for my dog gets it. Thank you all for hanging out with me while I ran errands today. It was nice to do a car vlog with y'all. But remember, give it a thumbs up and like it. Subscribe, 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 subscribe. Mm -hmm. Remember, subscribe, 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 share, ring that bell so you'll be notified when I upload my next video. Remember always, peace, much love.